Andalusia is uh, going to be one of the most vulnerable uh, regions of Europe in uh, climate change uh, effects. The issue of climate change is not that readily acceptable by people here. Is there any human-made climate change? Do we know that? And I believe that it's just evolution. We're just going through another cycle as far as I'm concerned. You can't do anything to stop climate change. It's about education, bringing this to light, bringing awareness to the issue. And therefore, the delivery of information is very important. It's OK scientists preaching all this jargon that the locals don't understand, but bring it down to ground level. Climate Change and the New Economy are very proud to have uh, sponsored and opened Bar Tropicana. We wanted to bring greater awareness on the subject of climate change and you know what better social arena is there than a bar where people come to talk, discuss, you know, great forum for discussion. It has made them think the topic of conversation has been nothing but, you know, climate change, is it happening, is it not happening? You know, a lot have been here a long time and they've seen the changes themselves. We do go through periods of drought down here, whether that is a cyclical thing or whether that's created by man-made causes, I don't know. Well, realmente el cambio climático está afectando a esta zona y creo que lo está haciendo por la sequedad que tenemos en el terreno en todo momento, que ha cambiado mucho con respecto a hace simplemente unos 20 años. We are going to suffer a 7% reduction of the precipitations, a lot of uh, droughts and uh, raising of uh, the temperatures. This winter in particular we've had no rain, we had a bit in, in October. I've got a river down the side here, it, we had water for one month. The agriculture, we can say that is the main economic activity of uh, Andalusia and uh, we'll suffer a lot from the climate change uh, because of the droughts, the change in the, in the seasons and the soil uh, corrosion. I've watched the farmers open their irrigation in the winter. I've never seen that in 10 years. So th things are changing. You used to get winter, spring, summer, autumn, and you don't. You, it's all mixed up. Eh, el ritmo de floración de las plantas ha cambiado. Encontramos en meses que no son normales que los almendros florecen, que la, eh, los naranjos florecen y todo tipo de, de árboles started growing chilies about four years ago and I noticed uh, last year that the fresh seeds and the seeds from previous years didn't germinate. I'm 100% sure it has to do with climate changing. In the last years, the rain is not like in the period that was more or less determined, but it goes in periods different and it's always torrential. In the WWF, we consider that still there is a time to take action. The role of uh, the business is to change the mentality and uh, see the future, is to invest in energy efficiency and renewable energy sources. We've learnt um, that water is a precious commodity. We recycle every drop of water that we can. Each one of us uh, is part of uh, the solution as we believe in uh, WWF. Like each one of us is part of uh, the problem and we have all together to, to work in our personal and uh, social environment in order to change. Yo creo que cada vez hay menos gente que no cree en el cambio climático, porque lo estamos padeciendo. Por lo tanto, hoy en día vamos poco a poco concienciándonos gracias al trabajo de todo el mundo y el trabajo If we can raise individual awareness, you know, then the community follows and then other communities follow and then we can all live in a safer, more clean and healthier planet for us, for our children and our children's children. Mm -hmm.